Hello, welcome to the channel. In this video, we are going to talk about how to change water and air filter for KitchenAid French door bottom mount refrigerator. So now if you bought a brand new fridge or your control display is showing that you need to replace the filter, it can be air filter or the water filter or both, then you will need to follow the following steps. Step one will be moving your fridge forward and turning off the water from the back water line connection. So now once your water is turned off, then you can open the fridge doors. And then on the very top corner there, it says water filter. Now I'll zoom in and show you how it opens. So once the water filter port is open, then you will need to install the new filter. Or if you have already a uh, filter installed, then you can take it out. But if you already have a filter installed, then make sure when you turn off the water from uh, behind the fridge, then dispense some water in the front dispenser so there is no leftover water in the uh, fridge water line. Then to replace the uh, filter, you will need to use every drop filter number two. So this one comes with a brand new fridge. So you can use the same one and then you can also visit every drop website or KitchenAid website or your local uh, hardware store and then you can buy uh, the same water filter. And the installation of the filter is very easy. The only thing is you have to align the face on the filter and the uh, face on the port in the same way and then you just turn it clockwise and it will get installed. So I'll show you that. Now filter is installed. Now once the filter is installed, the, the replace filter sign will automatically disappear. You don't have to uh, reset anything. The only thing is you have to dispense about three liters of water from the water dispenser on the, on, in the front so that the filter cycle is clean and then it will be drinkable. Then to install your air filter, that is the location, which is in the middle uh, top of the fridge. Uh, before explaining you how to install it, there was uh, a tiny detail that I want to go through uh, for the air filter for this fridge. So filter, uh, sorry, the air filter in this one is by brand Fresh Flow, and you need to replace it every six uh, months. And it says here it's for Whirlpool, KitchenAid, Maytag, and different brands so you can just keep the uh, model number for this one and order a brand new one every time you need it uh, there is a uh, there is a interesting thing in this one so when i open the package there is a new uh, air filter plus there is a air filter indicator so if you see i'll just uh close up here so if you see it gives you month two four six months and on the back there is uh like a like a bubble or pop thing so you press it to activate it so i'll show you once you install the air filter then you will need to activate it so it gives you the reminder that you need to replace it uh, after six months uh, this model of kitchenaid doesn't have an air filter reminder on the front control display but only the water filter so i'll show you this now so now to install air filter you will need to open the air filter uh, flap here and then you will install the air filter so the side clips stays on the front and then you push it and then it clips and then for the uh, six months indicator you just press the bubble or pop here and then it will start so you just put it like this and then you put this way and then you close it and then you will be able to see that indicator here as well. And as there is no air filter indicator on the front control display, you're good to go and continue using your fridge. Thanks for watching the video. Hope this video helps you to change your water filter and air filter. Please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.